how to import reviews from aliexpress to your shopify store hey guys welcome back to the youtube channel today i will be showing you a simple and easy way where you can import reviews off of aliexpress for your dropship product onto your a Shopify store. So let's get into it. Now, the best part about this is that I can add products from AliExpress. And once I have my products, instead of having to wait for organic customers, I can begin adding reviews that were put on AliExpress and get them added to my Shopify store to further add more credibility to my store and making my store or brand a more trustable brand for my potential customers so they are more likely to purchase my items. So let's get into it. Now, it's very simple and easy. I already have a video on how you can import products onto your Shopify store. So if you haven't checked that out, make sure to check that out because we want to make sure that we have already imported our product. So this is a simple product I've imported from AliExpress. It's a simple bag. And if I go onto AliExpress, like so, uh, I can show you guys the listing. So this is the listing that I imported. You can see over here, I have this bag in my Deezers account. So I use Deezers to import. You can use any other platform, but you can see it has a bunch of reviews uh, that were added and they are super good reviews. It has a good 4.8 rating with mostly five-star reviews. So what I want to do is import these reviews and for that you're going to go into your Shopify store. Now you can see if you haven't uh, built a review section on your store so you can see if I go into my current listing on my Shopify store it doesn't have any section where people can review the product. So the first thing you're going to do is go onto Shopify's back end dashboard and once you are on the dashboard you're going to click on apps on the bottom left. Once you click on apps, you can search for apps or you can just go into the apps and sales channel. This will open up this section and then you can click on Shopify app store or you can just head on over to the Shopify app store. And there are two applications that you're going to have to add. Now, you're just going to search for judge me. And once you search for judge me, there are two applications. First off, you have judge me product reviews. Then you have judge me AliExpress reviews. Now, a lot of people ask, why are you supposed to add both of these? The reason for this is you're going to use the first application to build a section where people can review your products because you don't want customers to be like, hey, how can they have reviews if they don't even have a reviewing section? And then the next step is going to be importing reviews from AliExpress. So you're just going to open up this application click on add app and once you add the judge me product reviews application we're just going to click on install app and once you do that we're just going to skip for all the installations but what you're going to do uh, you're going to click on adding your review widget so you can click on add widget and this is the standard you know widget so i'm just going to click on continue and I'm just going to click on next, install judge me. And now a simple review theme or widget will be installed onto your Shopify product. Now this will enable customers to review your product and rate them. So it just takes a couple of seconds. And now I'm just going to click on checking the widgets. So if I scroll down or if I'm just going to wait a couple of seconds, so I'm just waiting for this to be completed. Now, once this is completed, I can open up my store, visit any product. And currently, obviously, because I don't have any reviews, but I'm just going to make sure this is added. You can also click on review requests or you can click on customizing your widget to add, you know, a different theme or to make it fit into your aesthetic that you're trying to build for your Shopify store. You can also choose to do that. But once I've added a basic widget to my Shopify store where people can review my products, the next thing I want to do is go on back to my search section, click on apps. And then I'm going to click on apps and sales channel, go to the Shopify app store, and you're going to search for judge me once more. Once you search for judge me, you have your judge me AliExpress review. So this is the application. And then you're going to click on the application over here, click on add app. So once we have this application over here, we're just going to click on install application and we're going to wait for the installation to be completed to begin importing your product reviews. Now, I'm just going to take a couple of seconds to get this set up. So you can see the application, you can pin this in your app section. Now, once I've done that, I'm going to click on import reviews from AliExpress. 
Now, all you have to do is enter the URL of the AliExpress product that you want to add the reviews from. So you can literally add reviews from products that you're not even selling if you want to do that. But I wouldn't recommend that. Just add reviews from the products that you are dropshipping. And this is the product that I'm dropshipping. So I'm going to take this URL in the top of my browser. I'm going to go into my Shopify store. I'm going to paste this over here. The next thing is to import your Shopify product. So you're going to enter the name of the product which you want to add these reviews for. I'm just going to add one of the keywords of the product. So you can see you will get the selection of product and I'm just going to select my product. Then you can choose how many reviews that you want to add. Let's say I want to add four reviews. Then you can also add rating filters. So it can be a minimum rating or specific rating. Let's say I want a specific rating of five stars let's say i only want to import five star reviews onto my shopify store and you can also enter country filters let's say if you want to operate in the united states so let's say you want to sell your products via your shopify store only in the united states and canada so we're going to import uh, reviews only from those areas because they are going to relate to the customers that are going to be looking at the shopify store so after that, reviews must have content or must have pictures. You can also choose to only add reviews with pictures. Let's say I don't want to have pictures. It doesn't matter to me. But after that, I have my basic settings and you, I will just click on import reviews. And now it takes a couple of minutes. It can take two minutes, upwards of two minutes to uh, completely import the reviews. But I'm just going to continue on over here. And you can see I previously did a automation with this and I did uh, import some reviews previously. But I'm just going to go ahead, go back to my home page on Shopify. We're going to give a quick view to our Shopify products over here. You can see our reviews have been imported. And if I scroll down over here, I have these three reviews that have already been added and so on and so forth. You can get more reviews imported there's also a star rating where people can uh you know rate the product that you have and even click on write a review and then people can uh, you know give their own rating and give their own reviews and upload images as well as display a public name and email address as well so that was it for today i hope you guys found this video helpful make sure to like this video and subscribe to the youtube channel and make sure to also share this video with your friends and family and to other creators as well so you can help them out as well and to anyone that might need to know this basic detailed platform and how you navigate through these different social websites so i hope this was helpful enough for you and make sure that you do leave a comment down below if i missed out on anything and if there is anything you would like to add and i will catch you guys in the next video